sunflowers uh, patches have grown uh, two patches in the garden one is six feet tall the other one's four we have a self-seeded uh, sunflower right in front of the garden we have lily planted um, I don't know if you've seen our video of radish um, harvest day and we've harvested carrots and placed a pumpkin patch in that space there also, we have harvested garlic, we've stored our tulips, and so much more. So, if you get a chance, if you haven't already seen it, go back and take a look at our channel. And in this video, um, I also had to pluck up the broccoli because the broccoli, um, the broccoli, it just flowered before it gave um, fruit so uh, we had some broccoli crowns coming in but they were growing a bunch of flowers around them so um, I just went on and pulled it up and also we harvested some radish there's about mm, I think about 11 more radish that are not finished yet um, what else is going on it's so many things going on in the garden right now uh, i am so happy with the sunflowers they are growing sunflower heads already um like i said that they are six feet tall five feet tall in the beauty blend six and four feet tall in the garden and then my sunflowers are four feet and spencer's sunflowers are five feet um, near the greenhouse and oh, oh my it's so much going on so um yeah we had a we had a deer run through the garden <laughs> it's enough to poochie the dog um we just had so so much exciting things going on right now so it's um it's now time to get ready to start a pumpkin patch so we started that and um this is going to be our first time growing pumpkins so um you guys stay tuned for the pumpkin patch and um, we also have corn growing peppers growing uh, we might have some um sweet peas coming in really 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 soon i am so excited about sweet peas we lost our um, pinto beans Due to the snow so um, I was kind of sad about that because I really did want to grow pinto beans since we do eat a lot of pinto beans with um, stir fry bowls and things like that so uh, that was a loss but um, I decided not to go ahead and grow anymore I'm gonna take a break with the, the peas and beans I'll just grow what I have also, I started more zinnia in the greenhouse, but we had a really hot day, and it pretty much killed all 30 of the zinnia. So, I think I still have about four zinnias growing in the beauty land area. So, I'm just going to take care of those, and um, our lettuce is getting really big. What else? Um, I want to start some corn uh, cone flowers soon. So I think I'll be storing those up in the greenhouse and that will be the last, very last thing that I grow besides adding more pumpkin to the garden 
in the pumpkin patch. I'll start some coneflower because I love those. Those are pretty. They kind of look like an upside down sunflower. They're really pretty in the garden. They come in really pretty colors like purples and pinks and things like that. So I mean, I'm going to try growing coneflower. And like I said, this is our second time growing um, anything. You know, we just started growing last year. So I'm very pleased with how everything is you going. Want? Why you keep coming over here? I am a me. new green thumb farmer. <laughs> So also, like I said, I'm oh, excited man. about the cucumber plants are growing really strong and tall. Um, I'm starting to see some flowers, really small flowers on the cucumber. And um, the watermelon is growing really slow. So I'm not very pleased with that, but it's good to get some growth at all. Um, those tomatoes are blooming everywhere. The cherry tomatoes are really getting a lot of fruit fast. Um, we got some Roma and some yellow pear and I mean so many different tomatoes. I don't even remember which is which. Um, but we have them growing in all the extra tomatoes we had. I plucked up the uh, garlic and put those in that place. So yeah guys stay tuned for more. And we'll just keep you guys updated. If you enjoy these videos, please subscribe to our channel. We love the fact that you're here and we love your support. So thank you so much because without you, we wouldn't be here. Enjoy your day. Bye.